guys. You're never gonna believe what happened. I was doing my makeup, getting ready to film because tomorrow I'm going to Burlington with my sister and Nikki and the power goes out. So now I have no idea <laughs> what I'm gonna do because I need lights to film because it gets dark at 2 p.m. and I can't. I have no idea why my power keeps going out. It's gone out like three or four times for a few hours each time. And it's the most annoying thing because it's always right in the middle of the day when I'm trying to like get work done. I'm gonna organize and I wanna start planning my outfits for, I have two trips coming up. I'm going to LA and then I'm going to Florida with E10 for a few days. So I got some new stuff in, but I wanted to start planning. And then tomorrow I'll take you guys to Burlington with us. The power went off and I was like, I guess I'll tidy because there's nothing else for me to do really. I was going to refill my seed symbiotics and I was like, it's a great time to remind you to take your symbiotic and also remind you of my coupon code. So the CDS01 Daily Symbiotic is the probiotic I take. It's a prebiotic and a probiotic. I've been taking it for months now and I literally cannot imagine not taking it. So obviously the probiotics are going to give you so many gastrointestinal benefits. But what I like about seeds specifically is that there's so many systemic benefits that go beyond just your gastrointestinal health. So you're gonna see a lot of like dermatological benefits, cardiovascular benefits. There's so many benefits that go beyond just your digestive tract. This is just what they look like. There are 24 strain broad spectrum prebiotic and probiotic. So this is what they look like. I already took mine today. I take them every morning. What I like about these so much is that they have a cap and cap technology. So the cap and cap technology allows the probiotic to reach all the way to the very end of your digestive tract to make sure you get all of the benefits from your DS01 symbiotic. I got my refills, which just like look like this. All of our packaging is extremely eco-friendly. You first get your order, you'll get a glass jar, and then each month you will get your refill in a package like this. So I'm going to put them in here. I also have the travel case and what's so good about these and the Viacap technology is that you don't have to refrigerate your symbiotic. I noticed that these have helped so much and I do notice a difference when I don't take them. So if you guys wanted to test out the DSO-1 daily symbiotics from Seed, you can get 15% off your first month with the code Tony. And thank you Seed for sponsoring a portion of today's video. I guess there's a lot of organizing I have to get done. Um, some cleaning I can get done, but like I said, it gets dark so early now that it's gonna be dark and scary within a few minutes. All right, so I ended up coming to the office because like I said, I had no power and I still, um, when it got dark out, had no power. Oh, I was playing in the jewelry because I'm always here working. I never get to like play around in the jewelry. So I was like, oh yeah, these are extremely beautiful. Our radiant ring, not engaged. But yeah, I came to the office where we have all the jewelry and the clips, all the jewelry. Okay, so I realized that wasn't like the craziest tour. Um, I just don't know if people or you guys would be interested in that. So if you have any questions specifically about um, maybe like organization or starting an online store or any questions at all pertaining to CNC or a small running a small business, then leave them in the comments down below and I'll definitely start talking about it more on my YouTube channel. I just don't know if you guys would be interested in that. As you guys know, it probably looks familiar because our office is now in my old condo because my landlord didn't want let, to let me get out of my lease. But I was looking in the fridge because I'm parched. And for some, I've never seen these before, but we have these in the office. I don't know who put them there. Probably my sister. Dream World Zero Sugar Coke Dream Flavored. Um, What the heck is Dream Flavored? That's what I want to know. Of course we have a Leo here because he couldn't freeze at home. I wonder what dream flavored means. If these are here, most likely because my sister didn't like them. That's disgusting. What the hell is that? That tastes like someone diluted like Skittles in a Coke. That is disgusting. I need to tell her. I told her it tastes disgusting and she said, I know. <laughs> so yeah, my sister really takes care of the office. We just went through our biggest 
um, time of the year. So we're doing like a big cleanup. We had a big sale. Anyways, I'm just going to be here with Leonard until further notice. It says that they're working on the power now. So it went from cruise on the way to work in progress. So I'm hoping that by tonight, the power will be back on by within the next few hours. But I think I'm going to sit and edit um, and get some work done. And just all right. So today we are going to Burlington. This is what I'm wearing. Literally such a comfy outfit, a very oversized um, long sleeve black shirt. Lululemon tights, you've seen this outfit before. Um, some Zara boots and this Nicole Benisti coat. Okay, so we just got to Burlington. We went to Ulta, show them. So I picked up this Makeup Revolution translucent powder. It has a pressed powder and a setting powder. So I picked that up and then, then I picked up some fun stuff. I picked up the, is it REM Beauty or REM? REM. I got picked up the REM Beauty lip liner in the shade Harmonies. It's a nice nudie color. Can they see? Mm hmm. Same as, look, look, it's the same as my lip color. Then I picked up the um, REM lipstick in the shade Kiss Me. I've seen these all over TikTok and we can't get these out here, out there in Canada. Up north. Oh, a little bit of a shocking color. Let me see. What, do you, mean what are you talking about? And then I got this gloss, which I'm super excited about, in the shade Away Message. I thought it said massage. Look at this cute packaging. It's like a twisty tube. And they look a lot darker in the tube than when you swatch them. Except this one's dark. Mmm, feels really nice. I love it. It's like a lipstick, lip gloss, has a lot of pigment. And then I got the Maracuja Juicy Glow Highlighter in the shade for Lesson Glow. It looks like they're little lip balms, lip glosses. <gasps> Ooh. Maybe I'll put a little bit on my eyebrow for a little eyebrow highlight. I wouldn't like start highlighting my whole cheek with this, but it's good to do like the high points of my face so that's what i picked up from ulta everyone has their receipts yes ma'am what did you get i didn't get too many things um of course once i saw this i knew i needed to try it it's the tree hut scrub i got the vitamin c it smelled really good i've heard really good things about it and then tony was so excited about the powder that i needed a powder like i needed a hole in the head but i got it and then I got the a restock of my Nemat Amber Oil because they had it here. And last time I ordered it, I had to pay duty. So I was like, okay, I'll just get it here. Restock of my favorite, one of my favorite glosses, the NYX Butter Gloss in Madeline. It's a great everyday color. And I got the Deep Cleansing Oil by DHC. It's just a small size to try. That's What's what DHC? Oh, that's cool. I don't know. I actually don't know why I got this, but... I feel like I've seen it before and I love a cleansing oil during this time of year. What did you get, Nikki? I got a REM lip combo. I got the lip liner in the color Top Line because I like pinky lip liners, like Pillow Talk. So I got the color Top Line and it's very cool. It's swatched on my hand. Right there, you can see it. It's very cool. Ooh! I also got the REM lipstick in a superior color that I truly believe to be superior. It's called... It's lip gloss, Nick. Oh, that's what I mean. What did I say? I think you said lipstick. You said matte lip, lip gloss. Matte lip cream. <laughs> <laughs> In a razor pink. Ooh, yeah. That looks like exactly like your color. Put it on. What? Yes. <laughs> I was going to make a joke, but it might be inappropriate. Whoa, you put that all over your face. <laughs> <laughs> down here. It looks really good. I love it. How did it get color. down here? Would you like to try it with my lip liner? I got a new lip liner. Oh, pardon me, pardon me. Well, if you're nice, I'm going to try my new lip liner for you. Thank you. I would really <laughs> appreciate that. Would you mind putting this in the back for me? Oh, I love the it's scent. Pepper. It's like peppermint. Um, so now I think we're starving. It's 1248, so I think we're going to go hit up Panera, and then we can't eat too much because we have to hit up Olive Garden because 
When's the last time you had Olive Garden? Alicia said Vermont is one of her favorite states. <laughs> you guys know I love my Gucci horse bag, but I wanted to fashion like a strap that I could put over my shoulder. So I drilled a hole in the strap. And look, now I can put it over my shoulder because the, the other one is so long, it literally came down to here. So I forgot to show you my meal. Because? Because I was starving, but it was so good. The Fontega chicken sandwich, well done, with a side Caesar salad. And you have to put the, the mustard and the mayo on the sandwich. It makes the whole sandwich, like you can't eat it without it. You love the chips. I'm not gonna eat I my do. chips because I, I want to be hungry for all the time. I'll be hungry. Yeah, we're going to Olive Garden. It's rude to talk with your mouth full, Nikki. Tony always tells me that I do this weird thing when I drink a drink. And then she was like, this. <laughs> <laughs> how, am I, how do you take a sip? Like, are you... What do I do? Like, maybe once I do it, but you go... Okay, so we just got out of Walmart and we got some fun snacks to try. Cheetos Mexican street corn. We don't have these in Canada. And the M&M, you kept talking about these so I had to get them for my daughter. <laughs> um, crunchy cookie M&Ms. And then I also got the Walmart Chick-fil-A dupe sauce. Just in case Target doesn't have it. What do you wanna try first, this? Oh my God, this is what they look like. Oh, oh they're like puffed. I love Thai flavors. Mmm. Tastes like Cool Ranch Doritos. That is mm. really good. Now we're on Church Street, one of Burlington's biggest attractions. Yeah. They have the cute, it's like a little town and they have, they have the cutest stores. It's really sweet. I got my first pair of Uggs on this street. Hi, we're now here at the Black Cab Coffee Shop in Burlington on Church Street. That I'm, he loves because she went in stone. I'm here with a special guest. Alice of Dallas, and she's having the mistletoe latte. Can you explain it to us? It's a maple vanilla latte. I got mine with soy milk just because even though I don't mind eating or drinking dairy, it's just a lot of milk. <laughs> so I like to have soy milk in moderation. Okay, great. And, oh, 10 out of 10. It's so good. Not Would too sweet. Would you say anything about it? Honestly, no. I think it's delicious. And it has notes of maple and vanilla. Yeah, I really like ice because I find hot drinks give me a stomach ache. And they put a lot of ice. And this will last her well into Saturday morning. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> so we have the cha cha matcha here, which is chai and matcha. That is the black half coffee and beer. Look, they have all these. It's a 10 products. Look, Nikki, you should get this. Leave in for blondes. Leave in light. I love the shampoo and the Did treatment. you try the mask? Yeah, it's really good. This is good. the spray that I use and I really like it. The it's keratin really one. Really This good. one? It's like the best mask I've ever used. They have the cutest things here. Come, let me show you. This looks like Restoration Hardware. $2.99. Look at this cute kitchen set. They're beautiful. I like them. They're just too big for my bedroom. They're so nice. I would totally get those. And they're cheap. I know. Look, they have my bedside table lamps. I just changed these because they're gigantic. But they have my bedside table Did lamps. Did you get them here? I got them at home, but yeah. Where are we off to now? Would you like to go to Barnes & Noble? Yeah, where is that? Let's put it in the ways. Everyone, um, recommend a book for Tony's viewers. Okay, Alicia, go. I, the book of 2022 for me personally was called The Sweet Gum Tree <laughs> by, Ka I think her name is Catherine Allred. I read it in Greece. It was a total random book that I downloaded onto my Kindle. It was incredible. So she has a fetish. <laughs> she read it five times in a row in Greece. She read it twice in one day in Greece. I've been reading romance novels since I was a child at... <laughs> since you were a child! We also oh. sat down at a dinner table for an hour while she gave us a play-by-play -play of the book. A synopsis of Full what synopsis. happened. I'll have, Me too. I have like an unpopular opinion. I think Colleen Hoover's a little overrated, truthfully. I think she got a lot of people into the... Ro <laughs> I thought you were turning it off. Um, I think she got a lot of people into the romance genre then there's merit she collects trophies she hasn't earned and secrets her family forces her to keep this one this one <laughs> don't read it it's terrible <laughs> but reminders of him november 9 that's a good show those are both good ugly love this was i read this exactly a year ago it's my first colleen hoover book 
We're at Target. We're getting a lot of stuff. I got about 10 creamers, these cool little snack kits. There's so much stuff. Like, I hope you guys in the States realize how good you have it. We lucked out at Target. Yes, we got such cute and delicious things. But they only had pink lemonade spin drip for some reason. Oh, darn. Meep. You don't actually need this box. Who told you a million times that you didn't need the box? Look <laughs> how cool these are. The Momofu Momofuku um, noodles. Oh my gosh. What? Mmm. It's amazing. That is really good. These are the fried mozzarella. Oh my gosh. Mm. Really good. It's a bomb. It's bomb. <laughs> so we have the, oh, sorry, dirty fork. The chicken marsala fettuccine, baked ziti, and Allie got the chicken. Fettuccine. Because they don't have the chicken marsala plates. In. I just got home, but I thought I would show you guys what I picked up from Trader Joe's because I'm putting it in my um, freezer in my garage. I got these soup dumplings, which I've been dying to try. This beef and broccoli, because I love beef and broccoli. Um, I got this, these burritos. This um, mushroom ravioli with truffle sauce. Stir fry garlicky cabbage, I don't know. Sounded, sounded pretty healthy. These mini beef tacos. It's all, it was all frozen food. And then this was, Nikki's sister-in-law said this is the best. I can't even tell what this is. Is it pasta? I don't know. And then I got this green goddess dressing. I love green goddess dressing. This truffle soy sauce. This chili crunch onion. And what is this? Oh, this. I had the best day, but I also feel like I had the absolute longest day. Like, what is going on here? I look like a giant mess. So we went to Burlington. Um, normally we just go to Plattsburgh when we want to go to the States for the day. Let me close the door. To switch things up, we went to Burlington because they have an olive garden there, which I feel like all things were better as a kid. I used to be like obsessed with Olive Garden and this one dish, chicken marsala, they don't even have it anymore. They had a chicken marsala pasta, which was fine. Not as good. The breadsticks and the salad were still just as good. And they also had a Trader Joe's. So I'll show you guys quickly what I got. First, we went to Ulta. You guys saw what I got in the car. And then we went to TJ Maxx. And there I got this little vanity light with lights around it because sometimes the lighting in my bathroom, it comes in from the side and it Great shadows on my face so it was on sale I wonder what this looks like actually whoa oh it's like an iPad I have the worst pains ever I can feel when I'm ovulating and which side I'm ovulating from and this month it hurts so bad can you feel that too like I've always been able to feel it but whoa it hurts what else did I get from TJ Maxx? Oh, I also got these Magnesium Calm gummies, which, oh, by the way, on the way back, I don't know what happened. I was driving in the craziest fog storm known to humankind. I've never driven in fog like that. It was so scary. People were zooming by me. I was like, how, how, how are you doing that? Like, I cannot see two feet in front of me. My fog lights, I don't know what the point of those are because they did nothing for me. Anyways, we made it home safely, but driving in fog is terrifying. This is what they look like. You guys know I love the um, Calm Magnesium Powder, so let's see what this, these taste like. Mmm. Okay. And then I also got pre-ground salt because I've been making a lot of recipes lately. Like, whoa. <laughs> I've been making a lot of recipes recently that call for like a tablespoon of salt and I've been sitting there grinding the salt because I had no salt, so just got that. I always buy my salt at TJ Maxx or Home Goods or Home Sense. Now for Target. I picked up these Quest chips because they're so good. They're the perfect snack. 
each bag of chips, which is like a full, like you get a lot, is 140 calories, five carbs, 19 grams of protein, and 4.5 grams of fat. Then I got um, some of these little snack containers because you guys know I'm the laziest person in the world, and sometimes I'm really starving and I don't feel like making a whole thing, so I got these little charcuterie bites. Oh, and then I also got these. They're like, can you tell I love cheese? We don't have these in Canada though, you guys, like, we don't have them. You guys in the States have such cool things. Oh, I also got these Quest cheese crackers. This is what I went to the States for. You guys have the best creamers. So Silk Almond Creamer, this one is in vanilla. And then this one, I can't wait to try, Oatmeal Cookie Flavor. Another one of Leo's plates, because he's... Did I just... I thought I just heard my alarm girl talk because whenever a door opens, it'll tell me which door opened. I thought I just heard her talk and I'm on like high alert because I today the uh, the um, affidavit came out for Brian Koberger. Anyways, I got dental floss because I saw a hack on TikTok on how to like cinch a sweater with dental floss. I got these shorts. Target has the best loungewear these shorts looked so comfy so pick those up and then these looked so comfy too this like beige little tank and it had matching like these really reminded me of the skims wow i need to take some my doll i don't know what's going on another creamer this one is in sweet and creamy a caramel creamer i'm never gonna run out of creamer again I got two of these little pancake cup things because I'm not a huge breakfast person, but those are really good. I got some wipes. I got this lemon pepper tuna. And this tuna in a bag really scares me, but I'm intrigued by it. I got these boots. They're really cute. I made my sister get them. If you have um, like shorter legs. These are the perfect knee-high boots for you. Like the perfect. I finally found the perfect knee-high boots. And then at Home Goods, okay, I really lucked out. You guys are not gonna believe me. So I got this blanket. I'm trying to find a blanket to put on my little bench there because I don't know. I need to figure out something to put on there. So I got this like brown blanket. It was nine dollars. And then I was walking out and I saw this like little jute runner guess how much guess how much seven dollars for this runner so even if i put it outside if i put it in you know where i'm gonna put it i'm gonna put it in my mud room it's the perfect perfect little rug i have to clean my fridge and put all this away but i thought i would do a little state haul. it's not i didn't get that much exciting stuff i feel like the last time i got a lot more like home stuff but yeah, you guys in the States, you have the best snacks, the best food. I'm so jealous. Leonard, are you ready for bed? Are you ready? Are you ready for bed? I just gave myself a spray tan because I have to film some outfits tomorrow. And I was looking real pale. So went downstairs in my scary basement, gave myself a spray tan. I always put on like super big comfy clothes after. This is a really old sweater from Urban Outfitters. Today was a really good day. I had a really nice day with my sister and Nikki. Leo um, was with my mom. And I think I'm just gonna go upstairs, read a little bit more of um, The Four Agreements. I'm rereading it. And then hit the hay. I am exhausted. Leo, are you exhausted? All right, I will see you in 